What's up guys? Nick is back with Mass Effect. Yes, I finally decided to come back. Yeah, you have to sign on every single time. Uh, this is going to be skipped in the future. Just for the simple fact that it takes a little bit. But I'm returning for Let's Play... For Let's Play. I'm only doing one at a time. The original three that I was doing are over. New clean slate with this one in Mass Effect. Sometimes it does go through and it just like takes a second. All right. <laughs> so we're going to be doing a new career. And this game is kind of slow at the beginning. Establishing secure connection. Establishing secure connection. And we're going to be doing a select existing ID. So basically what this means is, I'm going to be playing a character that's already been made, that I've already played through. He's a level 37. That means I'm going to be playing a level 37 character from the beginning. Now why am I doing this? This is called a New Game Plus, basically. I mean, a lot of gamers know that, what a New Game Plus is. But basically I'm going to be playing the game through as the character I've already played it through once. So, whenever I well, what about like, unlock he grew up stronger and stronger things. He knows how tough life can be. All right, Anderson's talking. His parents were killed when slaves yeah, he's talking. Mindwar. So I'll let him talk, during the blitz. and I'll uh, talk to you on a second. Forces on the ground until reinforcements arrive. He's the only reason Elysium is still standing. We can't question his courage. Humanity needs a hero, and Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the call. All right, now there's some reading material. Weird, but whatever. And no, I can't skip any of this. And since this is a let's play, I'm gonna have to listen to everyone talk. I hate that, but I'm gonna have to. Everything's been carried over from all of my weapons, which I really only use two. I use a pistol or an assault rifle. Now, sometimes I do use a sniper rifle, but in this one I chose differently. Now, I've already beaten uh, one and two with this character. I haven't beaten three yet, so whenever I get to three, by the time I record, start recording three, I'll have already beaten it and doing a new game plus that way too. And yeah, I tried to make him look like me a little bit. He doesn't. He really doesn't. It's like he has my goatee, has some short hair, but other than that, I try to get to look as much as me as possible. And since you can't give his character glasses or anything like that, you know, the only thing I really do is like a visor or helmet, but that's only starts in two or three. So this one is just strictly as is. So I hope you all enjoyed this Let's Play. Uh, each episode is probably going to be 25-30 uh, minutes. Check. Navigation. Just because I enjoy Check. Mass Effect so much. And I think it's been long enough all since I've had a, a break. Drift. Um, here's uh, Joker and Caden. Caden's over there in the background, there's Joker, job. and there's Nihilus. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. And so you can you can tell the old style of uh, Bioware here. It's the where they just stop That's good. after they're done talking and it's like the they just turn their head unnaturally and all incredible. that stuff. It's weird. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The council helped fund this so project. most of the time I'm going to be talking to over the um, just because most of the conversations they have in this game yeah, are not that great so story. that's why they're subtitles and that and because I the official story. do that with subtitles um let's go with that they don't send specters I'm, gonna I'm going to be playing as a paragon so I'm not great at being the, uh, the renegade uh, Joe, and concerning Joe. Mass Effect 2 I do just know every lake, part on how to get Stealth a perfect suicide run Good. So, you don't have to worry about any of the characters dying. 
I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass. That's a plus. plus. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nile. Aye, aye, Captain. Now I was in the middle of playing uh, Digimon for the PS4, the and I'm like, oh wait, I was supposed to record after I left Thanksgiving commander? dinner because I really didn't have anything else planned. He sounds angry. Something must have gone wrong. So I came mission. home, started playing it. Captain always sounds like that when he's talking to me. I haven't even gotten a Digimon yet because I deleted my old save. All right, so here we are. This is me. So let's. I have a point I can use. So basically, you get one point, and it uses up one of these slots. Okay. So I can get one charm. Let's go ahead. So, usually when I play Mass Effect, I usually play through two times to get a certain character to stay alive. The last time I played it, I did it once. I was so happy. So if this game looks a little bit, like, different, it's just how the game is. I'm looking at it, and uh, I might want to... And I did take off the motion blare. It looks so dumb. Um, what do I have it at? Softer and medium? Uh, let's do that. Yeah, why not? Did that just, like, cancel out what I just did? It probably did. No. Uh, my controller. I'm using my newer con newer green controller for the Xbox One just because you can. Alright, let's... Let's use that one, see if that helps a little bit. That looks a little bit better. Yeah, I'd say it looks a little better. Alright, the Normandy ship in this one looks completely different from the second. That, well, you'll find out whenever we get to the second one. Yeah, I do plan on getting to all three of them. Now yeah, let's listen to them talk for a little bit. I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Yeah, if, I, if I'm just not talking much, it's because yes, most of the dialogue in some of these sections we need to, you know, Eden keep ahead of and understand what's going on. A symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish I think it's funny how you, if you look at his neck he kind of looks like he has like a human neck do you know That's just something me. your people are still newcomers Shepard the galaxy can be a very dangerous place is the alliance truly ready for this I think it's about time we told and here there is Admiral Anderson this mission Captain Anderson more than he becomes an admiral uh, who is played by Keith not Keith yet. David no, actually, I think it is. Eden Prime. Great That's voice actor. He has a apparition. great voice. What's the payload, Captain? What are we picking up, people? A research team on Eden Prime. Duh! Unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. What else? See, most of these, about? most of these, I don't even pick because I know what a Prome the last time Promethean. I know what a Prothean is. And all jumped that. our technology forward two hundred years. And when it comes to some missions, I'm not going to go all the way through them. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human and so, like side missions and all that stuff. This game, I just strictly go straight down the line, do all the main missions. Because I noticed when I was playing it, there was some side missions. I'm like, I don't know if I want to. He's here to evaluate. Because I, I was getting enough level ups, I had I was upgrading everything I needed to, time. so I'm like, you know what? Humanity I'm just gonna keep wants going. a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. You held off an enemy assault during the Blitz single-handed. You showed not only courage but also incredible skill. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. S yes, I, I support it. Of course I do. If I didn't, we wouldn't be able to continue. Trust me, if I had a choice, and this wasn't what's played, I'd be skipping through all this. Like you saw, I beat it in like eight hours from when I was loading the you new save. The ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Not <sighs> the company to observe the Investigate, now I'm ready. 
Just give me I'm ready! You should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. Why my camouflage armor? Wrong, Makes Governor? no damn sense. Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Okay, look at his neck down. He's supposed to be African American. From the neck down, he looks white. Get down! Oh no, it's Ashley! We are under attack, taking heavy casualties! Oh, male cat's being a goof. See, it's been 10 minutes and it's all been dialogue. Now, if I've been skipping everything, I would already be in combat by like 3 minutes. Oh, it's a giant hand! The talk hand! Anyone watch Jackie Chan Adventures? I did. It, it was great. That. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold the 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes when, out, when I look at Mass Effect, I kind of see Independence Day in a way, where Take the aliens came to Earth and basically wanted to kill this everyone. Just got a lot more complicated. But a it wasn't until the new one when we found out why they were doing it. It's our best chance to secure so, yeah. Grab your gear and meet us yeah, my, the my hold. Mass Effect character has a bigger nose than I do. I have like a medium sized nose. And Jenkins to suit up but, you know, like I said, I try to make it as close to me as possible. And, you know, he doesn't have a fat face and he's not overweight. It's like you get to customize your face, you don't get to customize your body. Engaging stealth systems. Stealth systems by nothing Somebody was changing. Doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary don't care. objective. The beacon's your top priority. <laughs> I don't care about survivors. Drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Okay, bye. Scout out ahead. He'll feed you status I kind of wish we had that mission. choice throughout Otherwise, these games. I want radio silence. We've got his back, Captain. The mission's yours now, Shepard. I'm basically going to be luck. an ass kisser. <laughs> Uh, okay, he clipped some trees. Alright. Gotta save first. Alright, we are now in... Alright. So, let's look at my gear. I didn't show it off earlier. That is the soft rifle I have. It has max damage. I can shoot that for a while before it does any... Any difference. Super that. That's what I'm wearing. The Ceno things. Um, Omni Tool doesn't really do that much. Now that's the sniper rifle I have. Or, actually, I don't care about sniper rifle. There's the pistol I use. HMWP7. Now, there is a higher one, but this is the highest pistol one we have. So, I I can do a lot of damage with this. See, this place got hit hard. in this game, it looks way different. And I do use, like, corrosive bullets, which I love in this game. In my opinion, it does the best damage. The only reason why I found that out was, uh, Screw Attack. When, uh, Ben Singer, I think that's his full name, did a, uh, a Let's Play of it. Where he, he also did the same thing I'm doing right now. Now, the cover system of this, way different. Everything's different from this game from the second. Never use that mechanic ever. Go here, go here! I don't care, just shoot! Like I said, Richard L. Jenkins. Now, some people think that's supposed to be uh, Richard Leroy Jenkins, which, kinda. Uh, hello? <laughs> what was that over over you, dude? We'll see that he receives a proper. Yeah, he kind of does. Wait, poor kid. But I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, sir. Oh, well, get that pistol back out. In order to put it away, I think it's like B. Yeah, melee in this game, you have to get up to the opponent, near the opponent, and press 
uh, press the shoot button for it to work. Did I get it right? Yeah. Just... In this game, which I, one of the reasons why I don't like the power system in this game that much, is you can only um, map out one weapon, and that maps it to the uh, right trigger. The left trigger just changes out your weapon. X does nothing. Look at upgrade kit. Now, since because I'm playing in the second playthrough, everything's going to be a higher grade. So that's always nice. I don't know what those things are. I just tend to shoot them anyway, because I don't care. Where was that going? It's supposed to do a lot of damage. Apparently, it doesn't. Oh, because they have high shields. Jeez. Go ahead and switch to the other one. That's the same damage. Look how many shots it fires until that thing expands. It hasn't. <laughs> it doesn't expand. Oh, there's Ashley again. Sorry, that's me taking a drink. Nice shot. Uh, uh. That close up. Ugh. That's brutal. The Geth are primarily the people you fight in this game. Then in uh, two and three, they add a lot more different, a lot more different, a lot di a lot of different enemies to fight. Where are they at? Right. Okay, am I using the right pistol? Because that weapon I just used did a shit ton of damage. Okay, it is. Oh, there's something else I need to do. Nope. Oh, nope. Nope. Uh, remove the helmet. I don't like my character having a helmet. It's just weird to me. Let me go get this first. Gunner Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Y'all probably heard me pressing something. I meant to wounded, move myself there so they can talk. And burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. These are, primary, are primarily the two people you need to worry about in this game. They Pretty much there's the a decision later on that affects the dig site mainly them too. And just over that sorry, I accidentally hit my microphone there for a second. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Move out. She joins real quick. In addition to that, I don't like my character having helmets. I don't like their characters having helmets. Do I have another one of those? What am I doing? <laughs> Pressing the wrong button. Um, oh yeah, I do have two. Nice. Alright, give it to her. When did I get two of them? Yeah, girl, you need a... Whoa! Hello! Okay, that, that looked... <laughs> that looked really bad, and it made her look like she got really fat. See if there's any other armor that's good for her. Nah. I don't use Caden that much, so that's why I'm not even bothering to in do anything with his stuff. And if y'all hear that, it's air conditioning. I'm absolutely hot in this house. It's like 30 some degrees outside. Alright, this is how co the cover system works. I'm not pressing anything. I squatted and got up against it. Now, I think with these is different. No? Same. You don't use the A button in the least. Who pressed that? Probably me. Okay, it does do a lot of damage. It's just because their shields are much lower than the others. I can pretty much plow through this entire game with just shooting people with a pistol. You see that? <sighs> but, uh, if y'all enjoy this game, let me know. Because... I, I want to come back to recording this and doing this 
the beacon at least two or three times a week. I want to get back to recording, but I'm only going to do I'm going to do myself a favor and do one game at a time. So I'll just play this game, beat it, play another game, then go back to Mass Effect or go back to something else that I've already recorded. Not already recorded. Uh, something, something else that was previously not done. How about that? And I'm not talking about uh, the ones I've already beaten. I'm talking about like uh, uh, Zelda Seasons or Ages and all those. Not the ones I just stopped. Those I'm probably not going to get back to. Those are like more enjoyment games instead of you know wanting to record because. Oblivion, I like to get lost oh, here. They're still alive. Oh, 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 oh. What did the Geth do to them? And now we have to fight the Husk. We make frequent appearances in this series. Wow, that one took forever to take out. Can I hit that one with that? Apparently not. Oh, I'm almost at 100,000. It's probably my next level, too. Alright, so let's show the, de the decryption. It's simple. You press the button at the corresponding time. That's pretty much it. You have to do it exactly after. And here's some people in here. Humans, thank the Maker. <laughs> Humans, thank the Maker. Before they come back. Uh. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you, I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. See, most of the time these people just ramble on about what's going on. It could be about the situation at hand. It could be about something else. That dude, your eyes. What the hell? Williams, take us <laughs> That dude, okay, uh, um, I don't care about these two. How about this? I'll skip main quest things. Did that just... Uh, that, uh, oh, that's an upgrade thing. Let's look in here. Let's see what's in here. There's an open crate. Or a crate that needs to be... Up. Caden, get away from me. Uh, Omnigel. Let's see what's in here. You currently have 137 items and you're in the... <laughs> oh, wow. Um, okay. Let's see if I can put any armor on myself. Because I just picked up a new one. Um, yeah, I can't even upgrade to the m mid. So, I'm kind of stuck on the light. Um, how long until the next level? It is 100,000? Oh, it's a little bit more than that. Okay, skip. Okay. Reaching 25 minute mark. Um, trying to think on what's next. Um, let's let this play out. Might have to end it here just because the next part will probably take 20 some odd minutes. Sarah. Dun dun dun! Who are you? He has mechanical this isn't looking your mission, eyes. Sarah. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the game. Uh huh. Considering the fact that usually the Council and the Spectres keep in. Co uh oh. Well, that's not good. But thank you all for watching this episode of Mass Effect, the first ever episode. Next one, we're going to continue on and. Try and see what happened with Nihilus. So, thank you all for watching. Catch you next time.